Hi guys, welcome back. This is What Out of Global, aka Zach, for those who know me, but for those who don't, let me just introduce myself again. So, as you guys correctly noticed, on my screen, where I'm pointing my mouse right now, could you guys see that? I have some weird, weird skins on my, my crews. Uh, over here you can see Donald Duck, you can see this guy, I don't remember his name. This guy's from the United States, he's a really nice guy. That's me. That's me right there. And you could uh, actually change these for whatever you want. Oh, uh, let's, uh, let's do this. Appearance. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, you can come here. Look, because... When I showed this mod back months ago, before I before I even changed my username, I used to have a different username, and then I changed it to What Out of Global so that I would match the channel. I changed my favorite username and I put What Out of Global, no problem, so that people would find me easily. As you can see, I'm doing this live. Look, uh, there you go. Des Games, that's me. This is that arrogant guy. This is I remember these guys' names, and this this is a really cool guy. I don't remember his name. This is this is a friend of mine. Um, this is, I can't remember his name, Mr. Whatever, he's on Twitch, he's a, he's a really nice guy from the NA server, and he's one of the sheriffs. There's, there's Tom, there's Tom, there's Jerry, there's Worms, there's, um, what's her name, that, that uh, amazing cat, which they make these amazing videos, very funny, uh, Owl Kitty, that's Owl Kitty, this is some random chick, this is, um, what's his name from Ratatouille? You guys know his name. Awesome epic guys. Uh, Iyuxin. Uh, I used to have skill many, many, many months before he came into the game as a commander. Uh, this is um, just for lols FYI. This is my friend from the UK. And this is our favorite comedian, Klaus Kellerman, ent ent entertainer. I also have others. But they're available if you go and try and change other crews. So, so as I was saying, I got special permission from War Gaming. I spoke to them, and I asked them if it's okay to do this, and they replied to me specifically, as long as it doesn't affect gameplay, uh, then it's perfectly okay. I mean, it's just skins. It's something. It's just in your garage, in your garage, and in your replays, you can do whatever you want. Because the replay cannot affect the battle which already took place. And your garage doesn't affect the gameplay. This is just in your garage. This is a, just a fun little mod. By the way, it's a permanent mod. And I will show you. I will show you what Des Games himself said about this mod. Um, let's go there right, right away. Okay, so this is a recording that I've kept for a couple of months. And this is the perfect time to show it to you guys. Now that the channel is growing, let me show you what happened live on stream. I sent this to him in a PM. He opened it and look at the results. Look what he said. Now, Artichoke coming in here to 38 months as well. Thank you so much for that. Okay, screenshot. Let me see the screenshot. <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> oh my God. This is a mod. <laughs> Oh my god, the best mod award goes to Beholder Guard. <laughs> Notice that he said Beholder Guard because that was my username before I changed it into what added global. And if you go back to my very, very first videos, you will see that indeed that was my username. Now look at his reaction. Look what he thought, what he originally thought. <laughs> uh, well, this is this. This is this is funny. This is funny. I want this. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh my god. The Photoshop skills though. The Photoshop skills are actually through the roof. Oh my god. The Did you hear that? He said the Photoshop skills are through the roof. He thought it was Photoshop. Let's hear that again. Oh my god. The Photoshop skills though. The Photoshop skills are actually through the roof. Hello, uh, Grieve. Okay, so that's enough of that. Let me show you 
evidence that I even sent him this mod and what he said about it. Okay, guys, and here we are. Now, back in May, specifically on the 5th of May, Friday the 5th of May, 2023, I had changed my in-game name, but I hadn't changed my Twitch name yet. So I sent him an email telling him, greetings, Des. This is what Ali Global, aka also known as Beholder Guard, in game and on Twitch. Well, I, I had actually okay, I, I had actually changed both, but you guys get the idea. So tell him I am sure that you remember the laughs we all had when you showed my screenshot on your Twitch just two days ago, which means he showed it on Wednesday, the third of March. I am sending you my mod. All I ask if you can feature it and share it with the community. I have included a special thank you note inside the files. You will find it in the readme text document. Cheers mate, regards Zach Athens Greece. And he responded. Um, two days later, on the, on the 7th of May, he said, thank you very much. So I replied the same day, said, you are more than welcome, buddy. By the way, I learned that in the UK. Enjoy the permanent, and it is permanent, it is indeed per This is also one other thing I wanted to say. This mod is permanent, guys. I never have to update it. It works with all versions, and I will show you how to install it. And anyone who wants it, I will send it to you. 100% free. Enjoy the permanent custom crew mod. I would be very happy if you featured it. He didn't, but that's okay. I mean, I understand he probably doesn't want to take such a risk. You would also help me... You also helped my channel grow a lot. Lots of love and respect, Zach Athens Greece. P.S. I changed nickname to What Added Global in game to reflect my YouTube channel's name. There you go. There you go. Now I got it right. Okay, so now let me show you how to install my mod for those who are who who want it and want to just have a laugh and have nice crew skins. Let me show you. Okay, so. Here we are. Now, for those who want my mod, all you're going to do, once I send it to you, you're going to, if you have 7-zip or WinZip, you're going to right-click, and then you go to your 7-zip or WinZip, and you're going to say Extract Files. After you extract them, you're going to get this. You're going to double-click. You're going to open it. Yeah, sometimes WinZip or 7-zip does that. It creates another file with the same username inside, but that's okay. It's only once. And then you're going to come here. I've also included screenshots on how to install step by step. They are a total of eight screenshots. I updated it today, today, the 14th of January. Yeah, and my cat is becoming annoying right now for some reason, my female cat. You are going to right click on GUI. You're going to copy it. Then you're going to come to your, uh, your uh, World of Tanks folder usually usually it should be in c or wherever you installed it and then games in this case in my scenario you're going to go to your basic world of tanks i have two because i got sick and tired of sometimes my mods get corrupted and my my game wouldn't work so i made a backup which is absolutely clean I use it for replays so that you guys wouldn't see any mods on the screen because some people complained about the mods. So, and also, I also have, I have a backup in case my basic World of Tanks folder gets corrupted. I simply copy paste the latest version and I'm good to go. I don't have to wait hours to download the game. So, it's a win-win situation. Okay, so here we go. I go here, over here you can see I have my ass lens, okay, whatever. We don't, we don't worry about that. So, let's go again. GUI, we're going to copy it. We're going to find our World of Tanks folder. We're going to go to res mods. Not mods, res underscore mods. You're going to go to your latest version. This is the only step that you have to do. Whenever the client gets updated, you just have to move uh, your your folder. Keep a, keep a safe copy of this somewhere on your hard drive. And then go to your latest folder. It's already here, as you can see. Right click and paste. Don't worry about this, click yes. It's not going to delete anything. It will simply merge the folders if you already have GUI. 
if you have mods installed. Now, in my case, because I already have it, it's asking me to do this. You're going to click yes, do this for all current items, in my case, to found. And then, you, and then if you have for some any reason whatsoever, you have something similar, you can either replace it, copy and replace. But in most cases, you're not even going to get this. So don't worry. You're, you're, you're going to skip. Some of you are going to skip. Most of you are going to skip this step, this step, I presume. Copy and replace, in my case. It's exactly the same file. Nothing gets deleted. Nothing gets overwritten. I'm just, I just showed you how to install my mod. That's it. It's very simple. And if you get lost, just come here. Go to screenshots, how to install. And open these. I show you step by step exactly what I just did. In eight simple steps. Copy. Go to your World of Tanks uh, folder, what I just did in front of you guys. Res mods. Latest version. Paste. And confirmations. That's it. And you're good to go. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know in the comments below if you want this mod. Just write your in-game name and which server you play. I will contact you. Don't write your email in the comments below. Don't do that. Okay? I will contact you. And if you confirm to me, I will send it to you via email. It's, um... It's, um... Uh, how big is it? Let me show you. It's... Uh, let's see... It's, uh... 25 megabytes. Nothing. It's nothing. Okay? And remember... This mod never needs to be updated. It will not get you banned. I have special permission from Wargaming. And uh, they said it's perfectly okay. It's perfectly fine. Okay? So, guys, thank you for thank you for watching. Tomorrow I'm going to hit you guys with a nice replay I had with the lift blower. Let's not do it in this video too. Let's keep this just as a tutorial. You guys were awesome. And I'll catch you in the next video. Maybe I'll upload it today. We shall see. We shall see if I have time. Bye-bye. I took special permission from Wargaming and asked them if it is okay